if you're thinking about investing in Lubbock, Texas, and you're not sure which way you want to go, if you want to lean more towards Airbnbs or have a long-term rental, well, today I wanted to show you this newest listing over in Overton. And you could do both. You could do either a short-term rental or a long-term rental because this house has it all. And we're gonna take a tour right now. Hey, if this is your first time to the channel and you wanna know everything there is to know about living in Lubbock, Texas, well then be sure to tap that bell and hit that subscribe button so that you can be the first to know about all things happening in Lubbock, Texas. I get calls, texts, emails every single day from people just like you looking to make their move to Lubbock, Texas, and I absolutely love it. So whether you're looking to move in nine days or 90 days, Give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email, schedule a Zoom call, whatever is easiest for you and your family. I'd love the opportunity to meet you and help you make a smooth transition into the Lubbock area. So as I mentioned, this house behind me would make for a great college rental if you have students or kiddos, excuse me, that are going to Texas Tech in the fall and are looking for a house for them. This house is absolutely perfect for that. That's exactly what the sellers did for their kids. Or if you want a short-term Airbnb, before they bought it, it was also an Airbnb. And the best part about it is, is it will come fully furnished. And so right now where I'm at is Overton and technically in South Overton. And I've talked about Overton a little bit before, but South Overton is very unique. It is one of the oldest neighborhoods in Lubbock. First, I need to point out, I don't know if you can see behind me, but the cobblestone streets, they are original. They have not changed the streets. It's not asphalt. It is the cobblestone originally laid in the 20s and 1900s. So definitely a very historic neighborhood. The majority of these homes, minus this one, were built in the 1920s, early 20s to the 40s. So they are going to be old, historic, charming homes. However, this house behind me was actually clearly not built in the early 1900s. So, but I will get into more details about that house here in a second when we go into the house to look at it. But a lot of people love South Overton because of the historic charm that it has. Most important thing is we are close to Texas Tech. It is walking distance to campus. So many kiddos will be walking to campus because this neighborhood does hold a lot of college rentals. So let's take a look inside this house and I'll tell you a little bit more about Overton and this house specifically. But first, let's talk about the exterior. The exterior of this home is very unique to this neighborhood. Like I said, it's not built in the 20s or, th or 30s or 40s, so it's a little bit different. However, this one was built in 2018. It has greenery, it has the shrubs, it has the front porch. And so it's a little bit unique for this neighborhood. That's why I really wanted to, to showcase it and really bring it to light. And from the front porch looking, you see the cobblestones. Across from it is actually a vacant lot, so that is always a plus, less neighbors, of course. And as soon as you walk into the house, you are greeted with an open concept living and stairs. So all the bedrooms in this house are going to be upstairs. So that's a plus. However, a half bath down here. This home is a four bedroom, two and a half bath home. This living room brings in a ton of natural light being off the very the, the window in the very front that is facing south. So you're gonna get a lot of light throughout the day. But as we walk around, like I mentioned, this house will come completely furnished. So everything you see in here, it will come with, including kitchen utensils, even inside the cabinets, there's kitchen utensils. So it is ready to go if you are looking for that short-term rental here in the Lubbock area. So as I mentioned, it does have a half bath downstairs, which is great, especially for guests. And I'll turn it around and I'll show you the laundry room area. So this house has a dedicated laundry room area. It has uppers and it has lowers. So plenty and plenty of storage, especially if you wanted to store even some kitchen items in here, you could totally do that. And my favorite feature is the backyard of this house. So I'm gonna take us in. So this store right here will lead us out into the courtyard. You have a nice covered patio out into the courtyard. And it's very low maintenance. There is shrubbery, there is grass. So if you have dogs, you know, you definitely have the grass area, but it's not a huge area where you're gonna have to mow it constantly or it's gonna take forever to mow. 
and we have tons of great lawn service people that can absolutely help you with that. But then on this side, it is concrete. So it's not all grass, easy maintenance, low maintenance, super easy to take care of. So as we walk back in the house, you go straight across and you actually have a two car garage. Plenty of storage over on this side and it's pretty rare to have a two car enclosed garage here in Overton area. Very rare. So the fact that you get a four bedroom, two and a half bath with a two car covered garage is pretty spectacular. So like I mentioned, this house was built in 2018. It's a little under 1650 square feet. And so I'm gonna take you up the stairs and as I do, I wanna also share with you my favorite part about this house is the location. This location is unmatched. It is less than 10 minutes walking to campus. So football games, basketball games, baseball games, anything going on on campus is super, super convenient to get to and easy to get to. Also to Broadway, which is our main strip of bars, restaurants, shopping is literally within the next few blocks over, about less than a mile over. So you're super close to all of that. And really it wouldn't take you no time at all to also, if you wanted to hop on the bus in North Overton, you could also hop on the bus in North Overton if you didn't want to drive to campus. So we have one of the bedrooms in here is just your standard bedroom. And then all the bedrooms, I'll kind of show you for the view from the top of the stairs. You have this little nook right here for they have the desks and everything here, but really you'll have all four bedrooms in each corner of the house. But the South Overton, which is where this house is specifically located, is really full of single family homes, lots of college rentals, lots of rentals, because it is just proximity to campus. You can't beat it. And on the other side is North Overton. The street that separates the two is Broadway. More so condos, a little bit newer homes. I've done a few videos about North Overton before. That's where you're gonna find some of those Main Street condos. And then also too, you're gonna be a little bit closer to Main Street, which has like Fuzzies, some other local bars downtown as well. But it's also, I mean, so similar. The houses in North Overton, gonna be around a little bit more expensive because they were built a little bit re more recently than the homes in South Overton, early 2000s. But you can find homes in that area on Main Street up to 500,000. So this area is full of college rentals and also, like I said, Airbnbs and short-term rentals. So more about this house, I wanted to show you the upstairs as well too. So these are the two bedrooms or two bathrooms, excuse me. So two bathrooms up here, so that way you're not having to share just one big large bath with four, with four students or with four guests. This house actually recently had some blown in insulation, which is very hard to find. So that makes cutting your utility bills, or that makes your utility bills super low. It's hard to find blown in insulation, especially in a two story home. A lot of these homes are not two stories, so you're not really gonna find that here. Also two brand new carpet throughout, as you can tell, as I'm walking through, they've also had new paint. They've also done new appliances whenever this house was built, new vinyl plank flooring throughout, newish, I mean, 2018 windows, you know? So, I mean, this house is ready to stink and go. So, if you have anybody that is looking for a short-term rental in the Lubbock area, well, then this house is such a great option. I know that the owners of this house love, absolutely love this house. It has been so good to them while their kiddos went through school that they, it's hard for them to sell it, but you know, they don't have any more ties to Lubbock anymore. So they're, they're ready to sell it. But you know, if you have ties to Lubbock and you just want to get down here for game days, well then this house is such a great opportunity. And I'd love to send you the link if you are interested in this house specifically, or if any, if you're interested in over the Overton area and are looking at condos or townhouses, like I said, this is a great opportunity for you to own one of those as well as we don't have very many close to campus, but there are some available right now at the time of this video that I could send your way. So if you have any questions or like to invest in the Overton area, I definitely love to help you and your family make that move to Lubbock. And until next time, we'll see you around.